good day everyone and welcome back to our youtube channel so we have for you something new that is national forensic sciences university recruitment 2022 we don't often post from this particular university and now we have an opportunity to so let's take a look at all of the details and by the way as the title says up to rupees 90,700 per month pay okay so let's see what this job entails so the National Forensic Sciences University is an institute of national importance and it's inviting online applications from qualified candidates for the following contractual posts. Okay, so the last date of submission for this online application is 10th of June 2022. Separate applications are to be made for an individual post. Okay, so there are totally about five different posts that are available. So if you want to apply for more than one, then you have to apply separately for each one of them. So let's quickly take a look at the details. So the first set of vacancies are in the food testing laboratory. The first job is senior scientific officer. Okay, and make a note of the postcode. There are two vacancies available and the age limit is not to be more than 40 years of age. So what are the essential qualifications for the senior scientific officer vacancies? So master's degree in food technology, chemistry, pharmaceutical chemistry, forensic pharmacy, M Pharm or equivalent from a recognized university, five years of experience in analytical methods and research in the, food, in the field of food analysis in any central government or state government organization or recognized research institute or forensic science laboratory under the central or state government and you should have adequate knowledge of English, Hindi and computer proficiency. So what is the desirable qualification, specialization in the field of food forensic analysis and quality assurance. So if you have a master's degree in food technology from a recognized university with five years of experience and adequate knowledge of Hindi, English and computer profi proficiency, then you can apply for this vacancy. Moving along to the next one, which is junior scientific officer. Make a note of the postcode. Again, two vacancies are available and the age limit is not more than 35 years of age. Again, your essential qualifications will be master's degree in food technology, chemistry, pharmaceutical chemistry, forensic pharmacy, M Pharm from a recognized university. However, in this case, you need to have three years of experience in analytical methods and research in the field of food analysis in any central or state government organization or recognized research institute or forensic science laboratory. Again, have adequate knowledge of English, Hindi and computer proficiency. Desirable qualifications are specialization in the field of food forensic analysis and quality assurance. Okay, so this was in the food testing laboratory. So the last vacancy or uh, set of vacancies available in the food testing laboratory is scientific assistant. Make a note of the postcode. Four vacancies are available and age limit is not more than 30 years of age. So what are the qualifications? Master's degree in food technology, similar to the previous one. Chemistry, pharmaceutical chemistry, M Pharm equivalent from a recognized university and have adequate knowledge of English, Hindi and computer proficiency. Desirable qualifications being specialization in the field of forensic analysis and quality assurance. Okay, so these were the set of vacancies under the food testing laboratory. You had the senior scientific officer, junior scientific officer and scientific assistant with experience ranging from five to uh, five years, three years and none respectively with a master's in food technology. Moving along to the next set of vacancies that is in the DNA forensics division. So you have again a senior scientific officer make note of the postcode only one vacancy is available and not more than 40 years of age is the age limit. So in this case your qualifications will be master's degree in forensic science, forensic biotechnology, biotechnology, microbiology or equivalent from a recognized university. Five years of experience in analytical methods and research in the field of DNA forensics in any central or state government organization and have adequate knowledge of English, Hindi and computer proficiency. Apart from that, desirable qualifications include you should, in case you have a master's degree in forensic science, specialization in forensic biotechnology or forensic biology is desirable. Specialization in the field of analytical DNA forensics and FACT plus qualified. Now the last set of vacancies available in this DNA forensics division is scientific assistant. Make a note of the postcode. One vacancy available and not more than 30 years of age. And in this case again master's degree in forensic science, forensic biotechnology, biotechnology, microbiology or equivalent with adequate knowledge of English, Hindi and computer proficiency is what is required. 
and desirable being specialization in the field of analytical DNA forensics and fact qualified. So what is the remuneration per month? So for senior scientific officer, it's rupees 90,700. For junior scientific officer, it's rupees 60,200. And for scientific assistant, it is rupees 47,400. So you have quite a good pay, okay? And the walk-in interviews will be on the 17th of June at 10.30 a.m. But like I said, you need to apply online. So before that, so 10th June is the deadline for it. So if you want to check out the notification for yourself and read it more thoroughly or check out any other details and if you want to click to apply online, both these links are given on this web page and this web page is linked in the description box. So do check it out for the link for this web page and also our official Biotechnica app because all of these jobs and admissions etc get updated in real time. Make sure you follow us on all of our social media like Instagram, Facebook, Twitter and especially follow us on telegram because that is where these kind of jobs get posted first okay i hope you've turned on your post notifications for this channel leave a like let us know in the comments what more you would like to hear from us and i hope that we get to see you soon for our productivity josh session that is going to happen this evening so it's a session that you do not want to miss so if you're curious you can check out the link in the description and you can register for the same okay all the very best and we'll see you in our next one take care